Hey everyone and welcome back to Assassin's Creed Origins. On this video, we're going to be doing the side quest, Blue Hooligans. And this one is over in Konopos. Right there. Let's fast travel to here. Why are the gods so cruel? How could they do this to you? And now, Icarius gone, too! Nebet, what grief has swallowed you? We... we came to pay our respects to Icarus. To make an offering for him to ride victoriously in the next life. But... but... Shh. Gently now. I'm listening. Blue ruffians came at us. They jeered at our sorrow. And when my Halius spat in their faces, they struck him down. They killed him. Then stole a bust of Icarus and ran. Now, my younger son Icarus has gone off towards the shore, chasing after those blue demons. I fear he'll join his brother. We came to mourn our hero, and now my family is destroyed. Please, my child, save my last son. Don't let his life end today. Go back to your home. Try to rest. I will find him and bring him back to you. Okay, blue hooligans. A woman lost a son to blue attackers and her other son vowed revenge. She asks Bayek to save him. Celine, a green fan, had brought her sons to mourn at the Icarus Memorial, but they were attacked by blue hooligans, who killed one son. Her second son, Icarius, ran off seeking revenge. She begs Bayek to save her remaining boy. And a thousand experience for this one. Not bad. Let's go, new horse. It's Retta. Whoops. Didn't mean to. All right, let's dismount over here. Call out Sinu. There's our target, and there's a bunch of dudes. Three there. Two over there, and... One there. Playing an instrument. All right, let's see what we can do. We got lots of sleep darts, so I'm not worried. Well, perhaps we can do this quiet. Let's see, maybe if I hit the side two really quick, I can assassinate the middle one. Oh, never mind, too slow. Well, I guess we'll just sleep, everyone. Why not? Your friends are all dead. You want some of this, huh? Wait, why am I not blocking? What's going on here? There we go. Ah, uh, put you to sleep, but I didn't assassinate because I'm dumb. Hello! Okay, well, that works. I got one of my sleep darts back. Sweet. By the hoary hosts of Horus, I can't believe Claridas lost to Icarus again in the last big race. It cost me a fortune. Icarus better not be fit, or yeah, Icarus better not be fit by the race, or I eh, can't talk. Icarus better not be fit to race by the time the Curses Magnus comes around. 
By soul in Degas, I must make my money back. Filthy Prasina greens. I swear, Onctify, if I hear one more of these Prasina greens chant and mourn the death of their precious Icarus, I'll beat one to death. Anyway, I'm leaving some of our hard-earned winnings at the small hideout. This race rigging scam is really starting to pay off. Quiet. I'm here to get you back to your mother. Quiet? I already killed everyone. Time to go home. Wait, Medzai. These sagging cocks stole a bust of Icarus that my mother had prepared for the great Sarioteer's memorial. They threw it in the river to defile it and bring a curse upon the Prasina green racers. We need it. Let me get you to your mother first. No. You must retrieve it before it is lost for good, or else my mother will never recover from her despair. I can make it home, but I am too weak to find the bust. Please, find the bust of my namesake and bring it back to my mother. As I must. That was an interesting insult. These sagging cocks. Okay. And a new one today. Find and retrieve the bust. Thanks for the offer, but I'm good. Even in death, you ignite their passions, Icarus. Let's get you where you belong. Alright, anything unique about this? Bust of Icarus? A small statuette bearing the likeness of Icarus, the chariot driver. Alright, well, let's go ahead and fast travel. Oh, it's not that far, but still faster. <laughs> I don't know why I love that. Hey, Papo! Uh, let's see, I went the wrong way. So they say it all the time. Quiet. Metai, you saved my son! A thousand thanks and more I owe you. The bust of Icarus. Now Prasina has a chance in the upcoming games. You are truly a blessing sent from the gods. We will make an offering to Icarus and the Prasina Green in your name. There is no need for that. But if you must, make the offering for my son. I would have loved to have shown him the spectacle of the Hippodrome. We will. Come, mother. We have to prepare to deal with my brother's funeral. Yes, of course. At least he's glad that the bust of Icarus was restored. Quest completed, Blue Hooligans. And getting closer to level 18. Alright, so uh, I want to do this location up here because it will give me a new papyrus puzzle that we're going to solve. So, let's fast travel to here. Oh, I didn't mark it, did I? Oh well, I know how to get there. It's the Great Library! See, nah, oh wait, it is that way. Yes, yeah, that way. 
Thought it was one more block. How did a player die right there? Oh well. Bunch of guards, but they're leaving me alone. New location discovered, Iseon. So back here is the papyrus puzzle. Deafening silence. Alexandria is large and noisy, but one part is quiet, lonely, and surrounded by water. The fallen palm tree points to where I lay, where land meets water. Obviously an island. This temple is safe for everyone coming to pray. Any who enters the temple is under my protection. Cleopatra. And I believe that's all there is here. So, the island it's talking about is not that far. It's right over there. So, let's either swim or take a boat. That was a little canoe thing here. Let's take that. And you can already see the fallen palm tree it was talking about. It's right there. <laughs> and the treasure should be right around here. There it is. Papyrus solved, and what the heck? Every time I get rare stuff on this profile, on the other profile I get legendary. This sucks. Oh well. Alright, and let's wrap this up with a Hippodrome tournament. So fast travel that. Tournaments. Ramsey's Divine Justice. I guess that would be Ramesses. Uh, maybe? I don't know. Whoever that is, Divine Justice. A race honoring the great ancestor. Can you earn Ramesses' favor? That's gotta be Ramses. Eh, whatever. Start race. Alright, just like the last tournament, there's three races. And there's a few new obstacles, but pretty much the same. Now one thing I have noticed, however, is that the other chariot drivers are getting much more aggressive and they will destroy you. So don't let them. I found that in the third race, they're very aggressive, and being in first place is not necessarily the best thing because they'll just ram you until they destroy you. So on the third race, I'm probably going to hang back in like second or third place if I can and be aggressive myself, try to destroy them. And if I manage to do it, there's a trophy, although I haven't actually destroyed anyone yet. The thing that makes the third race more difficult too is that there's four laps instead of three, so there's more time to get destroyed. Oh, turned a little early, bad turn, but still in the lead. For the final lap. Much better turn. Perfect. Yeah. 
the heck? I've never seen that before. Dude, like, committing suicide or something? Alright, take it to the finish line. First place. That'll be worth five points. There we go. Alright, so this race again, I think I'm gonna try to get myself out in first. We'll ram him too, why not? Yeah, take that. Take the inside track. Oh, what a turn! So yeah, we'll just stay out in front on this one. The next one is when I'm gonna be a little bit more careful. Because they like to come up from behind. See, the crowd's starting to throw these, like, smoke bomb things. Trying to obscure my vision, plus the rain. The rain's whatever, though. Now, remember, you can brace for a ram by pressing L1, and it seems to help a little bit, but it also slows you down. Or at least it seems to slow you down, so you take more rams in total, so it doesn't seem to help. See, I just did it there, and he just repeatedly ran me and did a bunch of damage, so I don't think that's the way to go. I think the better option is just to speed away or move to the side so they can't hit you. What is with... Oh. <laughs> Destroyed chariot. I thought there was like four people on the track for a second. But I have seen some. Take it to the finish line. First place. Run him over. Ah, oh, you missed. Oh, he didn't miss though. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Oh, look at that. I can't lose. Even if I get destroyed on the last race, I still win. Well, since I can't lose, I'm going to try to get that trophy. Destroy another chariot dra driver. Let's ram right into this dude. Take this. Coming for you. I'm bad at this. There we go. Finally hit him. Ah, what are you doing to me? I'm going to destroy you. Yes. This poor guy, I'm just picking on him. I'm also driving like crap. I gotta catch up to him again. It's this guy, right? I think so. He's probably wondering what he did to me. Why does this guy hate me? Ah, fine. We'll go after you. Alright, well, I can't seem to hit anyone. I'm not good at this. I'm just good at the racing. Ooh, somebody's really damaged. Right, who is it? Take that. Oh, what the heck did I just hit? Ah, oh, man, I'm not going to destroy anyone. I'm way too far back. Unless it's got some sort of catch-up. I must have hit, like, some debris on the ground or something. Oh, that chariot. Oh, wait, he's not destroyed. Well, we can work on it. Come on, get to the side. There we go. Yes. <laughs> oh, God. There we go. Got him. Totally worth it. Alright, final lap. I'm going to get, well, fifth place because I destroyed him. But it doesn't matter because I'm winning the tournament. 
There's probably much more graceful ways to get that trophy, but that's how I did it. <laughs> Warning, you need to finish before the time runs out. Hilarious, I'm that far behind, it's like, yeah, you better hurry up. The crowd's gonna leave and go home, you're so slow. Well, no points for that. But it doesn't matter, because I still win. The drachma rewards really suck. 150. I don't know what they were thinking with that. But you can see there's only two tournaments left. Making good progress here. Let's jump out. Okay, we're all done here. Do we have anything new gear? Well, we do have at least one legendary weapon. We also have a bronze kopesh. A sword trusty enough for both the lowliest peasant and the loftiest pharaoh. And we'll just break it, I guess. Okay, and then we had the legendary pylum that we picked up. We can break the non-legendary. Get that purple iron. And I think that's it. Apparently something new in inventory. Oh, it's just that new papyrus puzzle. Okay. We are finished. Thank you for watching, and I will see you next time.